Alright, watch this. I think it even happens. That little block there. That's the only thing that moves. This doesn't go anywhere. But no nozzle moving. So I hand pulled, well, hand screwed this off. And then, as you can see, I've got that to the end. How I did it was <laughs> pretty simple. Right, so I've got that there. Yeah. I put, I put the scissors around it there. <laughs> Get it to the bottom. Right. And then I put that shoe there. <laughs> and then I give that bit a whack with the other shoe. <laughs> like so. And then that moved it down. No harm. Get that off. Right to the edge. Now let's see if this works. Let's get this back in. Oh, through the top first. So we're at the top of it, come on. There's the top, and there's the bottom. And it seems like it just doesn't want to go in, but the screws need loosening. So get them screws out. And we need the top screws undone. Bottom ones just connect to that motor. I just confused your minds by tilt in the video. Mind confused. Right, I probably should have took that off completely, but. Oh, look at that! Look at that! Look at that, it's gone in. Let's just get that again. Look at that, look at that, it goes in. Oh yeah. And that is looking a lot better. Right, let's get these screws in. Look how it moves with it. That needs coming out a bit more, I think. Just to get that as flush as a brush. This should fix everything. Oh. Right, now while holding the screw down. Flush as a brush. Not too tight. Right, moment of truth. The moment of truth. Let's see this work like a charm. Mm. Fingers crossed.
We have lift off. So if you had the same problem as me, I just solved it. I'm buzzing. I didn't see any help about getting this fixed. And now it's fixed. With magic and a bit of shoe power. Subscribe, like, and comment. There'll be projects now that the thing's fixed. I've got many in mind, I can't tell you, and disc skulls and divulge. But yeah, I can't wait. If you've got a CR10, let me know if they solved your problem. Basically, if it comes with a bit of flush at the top, or you end up with squidgy bits, basically, nah, if it's flush at the top, you're fine. If not, if your lead screw's popping out a little bit, do this.